Power PDF provides a tool for editing basic content within a PDF document. Let's first discuss the Edit Object tool. The Edit Object tool allows you to make minor text revisions to a PDF document, including modifications to attributes, font type, size, fill color, and so on. If the PDF document is secured to prevent editing, this tool is not available unless you get permission from the author. See Digital ID Settings. You can only change text and properties if the related fonts are available in your system or embedded in the document. See Embedding Fonts. Note that editing should be kept to a minimum because the PDF format is mainly for document exchange, distribution, and publishing, not for large-scale text revision. Text editing may not succeed on text where only a subset of the original font is embedded. Larger modifications to PDF page content are better made using the Advanced Edit mode. Edit Object is designed to edit textual content and images, graphs, and other elements within the document. Let's take a look at how we can edit our text using the Edit Object tool. With our document open in Power PDF, click the Edit tab, then click Edit Object from the ribbon toolbar. Click any text line, and then select the floating tooltip to see the available edit operations. For example, I can easily delete a line of text by selecting it, then from the floating tooltip clicking Delete. Another way to edit the text is to highlight it as before. Then right-click on the text to open a menu where we'll select Properties. The Object Properties window opens, and we can now modify our text in various ways. First, let's click the Text tab to change the font to Arial Bold. Next, we'll change the fill color to red. Then we'll change the font size to 8 point. Close the Properties box to view your changes. It's important to note that in order to edit text in a document, the fonts used in the document must be available on your system. If you click on the Edit Object tool and are unable to directly edit the text, that means that the PDF document you're working on has text properties such as font or point size that are not available on your system. In order to edit the text, you need to open the properties of the text object and change the font to the one that is listed, then change the point size to one that is listed. Once you save the file, you can reopen it and edit text normal. Now let's take a look at how easy it is to touch up and resize objects. With our Charts and Column PDF file open in Power PDF, in the Edit tab, we'll click on the Edit Object icon. Now we'll click on a slice in the pie chart to select it, then click and drag the anchor points to resize it. Let's say we wanted to switch places between the yellow and green slices. We would simply click the green slice to select it and move it out of the way. Next, we'll click the yellow slice and move and rotate it into position where the green slice was. Finally, we'll click the green slice and move and rotate it to where the yellow slice was. So in conclusion, the Edit Object tool makes it easy to make minor text and object edits in Power PDF by selecting the Edit Object button from the Edit ribbon and then using the functionality of the Edit Object to make your minor edits or changes.